What is going on everybody? My name is Connor, but you guys can call me Spear and today you guys are gonna be watching a double KM strike with the Maverick and that sexy sexy spectrum camo But this gameplay kind of gets me depressed just because in this gameplay I think I died about six or seven kills off of my first ever triple chem now I know a triple chem playing in a full party nearly at least what I would almost kind of call a little bit of spawn trapping um, getting a triple cam even doing that really isn't that impressive of a thing but I have been going for the triple cam guys and I really do hope that here in the next few days or weeks or whatever I can bring you one because it really you know it's it's a feat that I've been striving for in Call of Duty a triple nuclear triple mob for so many years now that you know I really want to get a triple something so you know it is kind of is sad that um, I died off of it in this gameplay and I think uh, the reason that I died was I had to play really reckless because there was only two kids left in the game and it seems like that is a big problem whenever I get a full party together and we pub stomp. So I just kind of sit here and I just pray whenever I see a good pre -game, a good bunch of crappy players on the other team and a good map and everything. So I just pray that uh, you know we can get some players that stay in the game and don't actually leave and that that is an extremely rare thing to come by nowadays and you know it kind of leaves me to wonder what would the gameplay standards be if no one if you weren't allowed to leave the game or if like this was league play from call of duty black ops 2 where if you left a game you know you would be punished and kind of put in a timeout so to say and not be able to play the game for about five ten minutes and you know, I think like in Black Ops 2, the best game player the most kills was like 316 kills. And you know, there could have been like a 400 plus kill gameplay if everyone just stayed in the game and was not able to leave. And I think I definitely would have a triple chem strike because uh, I kind of have this motto that whenever I play Blitz, I only play one side of Blitz. And what I mean by that is, you know, I get the first side when the game first starts is I play that full side for five minutes with a full um, four to six people on the other team, but then the second side comes around and, you know, I may have a KM strike, or chances are me or someone on my team has a KM strike, and the other team is just completely getting ran over, um, by the time the second round starts that no one's left in the game, and the game either ends because the enemy's forfeit, or, um, you know, whatever it may be, and if they just leave because they don't want to stay there and get absolutely pounded, so, basically, what I'm saying is this gameplay is extremely frustrating to watch, or maybe not to watch, but it was frustrating to get because I get the first chem strike like a minute and a half or a little over a minute and a half into the game. And, um, you know, it really is a bummer that I wasn't able to get more than just two chem strikes because right when I got that first chem strike, you know, me and everyone on my team was just thinking, oh, triple chem superior, you got this, man. You got the triple chem, man. Not a problem. And um, to be honest, I, I don't mean to sound cocky when I say this, but I think I think I could have gotten the triple chem if there were more kids on the other team. And, you know, it just sucks that everyone was able to back out. But I think I finally figured out what I'm going to do for five thousand subscribers and i think the first thing i'm gonna do which you guys saw for three thousand subscribers is gonna be a setup video but i think if i took a picture of my setup video at three thousand subscribers and then a picture of it at five thousand subscribers you would pretty much think it's in a completely different house with a completely different setup and another thing i'm gonna do is i think i'm gonna give away a spectrum camo code now please don't drop comments down below saying that um, you know, you want me to give two because I don't have one yet. I think it's going to be for the 360, but I'm not too sure yet. So drop a comment down below, letting me know what system you want me to give away the Spectrum Camo Code for. Um, other than that, please leave a like if you guys did enjoy. And if you don't like what I'm going to do for 5K or you have something wrong with it and you'd rather see something else, just drop a comment down below and I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as possible. But other than that, guys, have a fantastic day. I am out.